It's a difficult question to answer. I just love being outdoors. I'm a, I'm a passionate mountain walker. That yep. is what I love. And I say, people said, you love it? I said, no, I'm passionate about it. It's something I do with every spare minute I've got. I mean, I'm in the local mountain rescue team, which takes me up and I've been up here many times carrying stretchers in the pouring rain. It's just something you love. So I can't explain it. There are moments where you feel like, okay, now it's been enough. No. Ne never. <laughs> no, never. <laughs> okay. Even in the worst weather, you just think, well, it'll be better tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, cool. so you are running the society who? Uh, yeah, I'm running uh, Angeles Borders, which is a national charity, um, and it's represented by around 20 universities around the UK. And we do various things like um, going into local schools, teaching about um, engineering and international development. Mm -hmm. And one of the aspects of doing of our society is we try and organise these um, field trips to the national park. Um, it's a good opportunity for us to get away from university life, um, exams, deadlines, etc. And um, just you know, help out a bit. Um, this is our second visit in the last 12 months. And um, we try and come up with new people uh, okay. so they get a chance to experience uh, the National Park. Um, a lot of people are not from the Manchester or Lancashire area, so they, it's a great chance for them to get to know uh, the natural beauty um, and then get away from city life essentially. And uh, last time, uh, what was the what were the feedback of people who uh, came? Everybody were um, mostly everyone's really tired. Um, yes. <laughs> uh, they not used to doing manual labour for two days, but um, they get away from kind of internet and cell phones for two days, which is actually quite refreshing. Um, yes. And uh, Generally, we come with a group of people who don't know each other either. Mm -hmm. um, they may have met, met each other once or twice at university, but they're not close friends. So it's a good uh, opportunity to kind of make new friendships and uh, bond. So they really enjoy it. It's generally quite good. If the weather's like this, then um, can't really complain at all. The mining out. Can't oh, yeah, I do other jobs. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, other jobs, yeah. So as I said, we do this uh, Monday. Yeah. Job, we do <laughs> so um, what is your, um, what, what do you do oh, in the park? Uh, well, I'm, I'm doing the Pennine Way from okay. north to south. This is my 20th day, my last day. Oh, so so you will, I'm going to Edale now. So you will be done today? Done today, yeah. So how many kilometres today? Um, today is 16 mile. Okay. Wow. Um, yesterday was 25 mile, which was a bit much, but yeah. I had to get down so and you do get it, it done for um, the weekend. So is it the first time you're doing it? Or? Yep. Great, and how is, what is your um, um, I feel good. Um, my feet are aching a little bit, but I feel yeah. grand. <laughs> and um, all my family will be waiting for me. Wow. So I just can't wait to get, get down there. And um, can you talk about the nice experience you had? Um, the River Tees with all the waterfalls, absolutely fantastic. Okay. Yeah, beautiful. So, so that was the one of the best um, parts best of the memory. Pennine Way, yeah. Great, and so would you recommend it to someone else? Yeah, everyone. Yeah, everyone. Um, meeting different nationalities, mm -hmm. um, just a great experience. Great, wow. Yeah. This guy is finishing the Pennine Way today. And, and how long have you been walking? 20 days. Okay. Today is 20 right. days. Yeah. Are you happy to finish it or are you like, um, yeah. I mean you're so close literally, <laughs> we can see yeah. the road from here, so yeah, I, I am it's really very, close. I'm very happy to finish. Okay. Um, <laughs> it's, it's been very long this last two days yeah. because I've missed my family oh, right. and um, they'll be waiting for me around about two o'clock in Edale. Better. And how about the surrounding area, the nature? Does it change a lot during yep. the walk? Oh, right. The wildlife, there's lizards, black grouse, um, the further north you go, and there's um, deer, and um, all kinds of, you know, and down here it's mainly um, 
curlews and lapwings <laughs> and sheep. Sheep are always there. Yeah, they, I mean, yeah. all the time. Mm. They're always sheep in England. <laughs> Lots of sheep. So I guess you're really excited to to meet your family yeah. today. I've so four-year-old as well. So he'll be waiting for me. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, I've got great. seven others as well. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that's a lot. <laughs> Every day, easily something to buy to eat or anything. Um, what about the for the first 27 miles? There's nothing. Okay. It's just open moorland, so you've got to drink the water from the the river Coquette. Um, you put little pills in, you know, to yes. ne neutralise, so, yeah. And um, then you can go from village to village then and get water from taps. Or knock on someone's door, which I did. I knocked on people's door, or farmers, and they'll give you water. They're very happy to. They're really welcoming. Yeah, very, yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you. Come here. Every week we have a group of, um, of adults who require learning support who come out and volunteer just the same as these guys do. So. We, we try and engage and work with the volunteers for anyone. Anyone who wants to give up some time and come out and help us, we're more than happy. We're really grateful for the work that they do. So it doesn't matter if, if what section of society they come from, is that we can find and tailor a project to fit in with them. What would you say personally? Like, What is the very special thing for you about this national park? Watching other people smile. Oh. <laughs> I think you managed to, to make everybody smile today. <laughs> yeah, I, I think we had a brilliant time today as well. So you have to bring the rest of your college now. Yeah. There's no <laughs> point just bringing a camera. <laughs> bring many I want the whole group. <laughs> <laughs> and you can come and volunteer for the weekend. Yeah, we should. Yeah. We could, uh, Seriously, we should talk about it. <laughs>